Hi again. Today I will give you a trading idea regarding one stock and also I will give an update um, for other stocks and other trades that I've entered um, in previous videos. Um, first one uh, is the idea of this stock here is which is uh, JD. Um, as you can see here, this is weekly short. I will go to the bigger time frame, which is monthly short. We have this support area that um, it looks that it will hold till now, but I don't actually like this candle here if we closed the month and actually we did close uh, because this today is the last um, um, day of the month. So it looks till now, it looks actually bearish. As you can see, this is the order block or last supply. And we have got a reaction from it which, with this uh, 2G um, candle. Um, if we look to lower time frames, maybe uh, back to daily, we will see um, that we actually we broke the 200 uh, exponential moving average which is a very good sign that we may go to the upside um, but it's better if you want to be 100 percent sure um, of course not one not 100 but more sure uh, that uh, you may wait for this resistance to be broken first before you enter um, but we have a good sign here breaking the 200 EMA but as you can see here we did broke it before but we didn't break the resistance so we went down so you can uh, wait to see if we will get a reaction from this resistance or we go above it if we go above it it is a very good um, it would be a very good trade maybe try, try to target any of these um, resistance areas here, here, maybe just here, and maybe just um, ex expand um, and give us another extension. That's the new idea. I will go to the other trades that I've shared before. Uh, one of our my best positions is in MIGI, which is a awesome infrastructure. Uh, actually, we started to see... Um, good um, signs of our uh, position because we have this um, reaction here and actually is it's still holding but um, we didn't break this resistance yet so till now we are just waiting and also um, I said that I may enter a position, which is I which, um, which I did in Stronghold Digital Mining. Both of these countries are for mining crypto coins and Bitcoin. And as you can see here, I have seen this setup and uh, this um, move or leg that broke uh, structure or broke resistance. It didn't break it actually very clearly but i think it's the start of a move maybe go liquidate this area again and then go up as you can see here we are just in something that looks like channel and we have liquidated the lows underneath this and also underneath this channel so it may work it may not um so so we are just waiting and also, one of my um, best setups is in every holdings. And I will go to monthly short because we have a very good setup here. And I think this one will go way, way, way up, but it will take time as this is monthly short. And actually, we are now at underneath the 77 um, retracement level of Fibonacci. 
I expect this stock to go to these areas here, like this, which is 60, maybe 67. How do I expect that from just looking at this short? Um, because if some people, as I said before, regarding fundamental analysis, some people just already did the research regarding this company that's why you have you are seeing this setup that's why you are seeing that this here these um people who did this research they made this um panic selling just to buy it from here and then it went up like crazy after that which means that they know something that you don't know so you don't have to look and fundamental and you can see, yeah, I don't see anything in this balance sheet or whatever. They see something and you don't see it. So, but they can't, um, this information, sometimes you don't have access to it or they get it um, and uh, because of the, they do extensive uh, research or whatever, but you have access to the short and the short will tell you exactly what they are doing. Uh, regarding our position in oil, I have closed it actually because I have seen uh, I wasn't com uh, quite comfortable with it. I have closed it uh, actually here or so. It was maybe um, some uh, were on break even, some with a little bit profit, but uh, as I said before. This was my entry here, this gap. Um, I thought that we are just manipulating the uh, trend line. It was like this. And, and I've entered uh, here. And I always put my stop loss underneath this wick here. So it's like here. So I didn't, um, I got lucky because I didn't, I, um, I didn't been, I haven't been taken out um, with this because I don't exactly put it here. And um, it may actually still go up, but I, I'm not quite comfortable with this setup anymore because now it looks like it's actually broke because uh, before uh, this happened, um it was i was here uh, and um it didn't uh, show us a clear sign that it uh, the trend line has been broken because if you look here it was like this so i thought it will be just this is just manipulation and it will go up but now it's not actually now i think it's actually a sell setup and this is actually a bearish flag it's just taking the liquidity from these tops and then maybe just go and retrace back to this area and then go to the downside so i will leave it i won't uh, enter a buy i won't enter a sell because i'm not sure actually um and the same i did the same with um, the gas um natural gas i actually entered a put a position in United States Natural Gas Fund, UNG. I exited um, on the touch of this um, exponential moving average on daily short because actually I also found I entered, I, my entry was good, to be honest. I may regret uh, that I have uh, exited maybe early, but I have seen this candle here and i have seen this look at this um volume it's a very big volume which uh, telling us th that actually maybe the trend is still going down um we still i think we still have one stock i wanted to discuss I think that's that was it. Yeah, I have discussed everything. Um, 
so till next time have a nice day